Well, um, you know, part of why we're having this is I don't know if um, if you heard about this, but uh, Matter recently just announced a bunch of service changes. Um, so they're going to be voting on those on Thursday, and they're going to be affecting like almost 30 bus routes. Um, so you know the proposal they're talking about, like that's like it's really going to hit like most of the whole system. Um, so right now, Matta is talking about cutting seven whole bus routes. Um, one of them is the 46 Whitehaven, which comes down in this neighborhood, which is part of why we had this today. Um, but there are also, you know, a lot of other parts of town that are going to get hit by that. So, um, you know, a lot of these cuts are really just like targeting communities that um, don't have like don't necessarily have like a whole lot of people in them, but a lot of those people are relying on the bus to you know get to work and get to school and like all kinds of stuff like that. Um, so you know things like the 38 that serves the Boxtown neighborhood that's like west of here. Um, like that's an example of a neighborhood that like you know if Madden takes their bus away, they, got no they like they don't have like no other service over there. Right. So. If they cut the bus route and you don't have a car and you live in Boxtown, then you'll just be out of luck. Yeah, because right. they're not, you know, they're not trying to like replace that service with anything. Right. Um, so, you know, a lot of that is why, you know, we've been um, having like small meetings like this in other neighborhoods around the city. So like um, the first one we had was in South Memphis. Um, the last one we had was in Frazier. So and then we've also been doing a lot of like phone banking and canvassing and stuff like that just to you know make sure the people in the city are knowing about all these changes that are going on because um, matter will often just kind of do stuff real quick you know what I mean without really letting people know and again you know I want to say uh, that you know if you really look at the magnitude of this city and the people that depend on transit in the city of Memphis uh, you know we got a lot of people that depend on uh, transit depend on uh, Mallard to get to their jobs. You got people that depend on Mallard to, to go to grocery stores, you know, the elderly people and stuff like that. So this has an effect on everybody, you know. Current status on the route, where it's operating today and what's proposed. Thank you. 